to our program. We are now to cast out demons and to bring good tidings unto you as the agents of Jesus Christ to his people. Dear televiewers, are you sick? Your sickness is something to be removed within seconds. Have you delayed pregnancy? The Lord is about to serve it right now. Right now, the Lord is going to do what your human imaginations can't understand. Get ready, as I put my hand on the screen for you, get your cup of water, get your bottle of water, whichever container of water you carry. God is everywhere. God has no limits. Your distance is reachable by the Holy Spirit. Have no doubt in you. For if you have doubt or you have fear, it is not faith. Faith does not have doubt. Faith does not have fear. So once you have doubt and you have fear, Faith is not your portion. So as a generation of children of faith, receive now in the name of Jesus of Nazareth. Almighty Father, let your name be glorified in this prayer this morning. And let your name be magnified. Take your water right now and place it where my palm is and I pray Almighty God as I stretch my hand unto them all Father that my palm has become your palm or behind my palm is your palm let whosoever will touch the screen with the water in his hand Receive power within that water and let the water, having received power, push some of them to the ground to know that the Holy Spirit has fallen there. And let them fall to the ground and even start muttering words that they don't understand. Almighty Lord Jesus, move now by your Spirit. As to touch the water on my palm through the screen, and your hand is behind my own or within my own, let that water receive power. In the name of Jesus Christ, let that water receive power. In the name of Jesus Christ. My God, my Lord Jesus, can do anything using anything to make you happy, to make us happy. Place that water on my palm, on your screen. I cry out unto the Lord, Abba, Father, Lord Jesus. I cry before your sanctuary. I cry before your holiness, bring to pass that which is essential for these people to receive from you the blessings that they have so longed for many years. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, 
in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Touch your water now on the screen. And after you have touched that water, don't drink it. Don't use it yet until I give you the command on how to use it. In the name of Jesus Christ, Holy Spirit, move and put power within that water. Put power within that water, O Holy Spirit, that the Lord may be glorified and magnified in heaven and that the faith of his people may grow stronger and stronger. In the name of Jesus Christ, power in your water. Power in your water. Power in your water to do many things. To do many things. To cast demons out of you. To heal you. To bless you. To bring you breakthroughs in all your endeavors, in your businesses, in whichever area, farming, school, whatever. Power in the mighty name of Jesus. I command that water to receive power in the name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Father Almighty, receive the adoration, the honor, and the glory that this day you are making once more manifest your power unto the children that we are and who belong to you. That Lord Jesus, our faith may grow stronger and stronger in believing you as our personal Lord and Savior. Receive power in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. The water in your bottle, the water in your glass, the water in any container you've chosen, touch it on the screen now and the Lord converts it into a different level of water. In the name of Jesus Christ, the living, omnipotent, omniscient, and omnipresent God, receive in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You have olive oil? Take your olive oil now. You don't have it. Rush and buy even that type for 600 francs. They use on babies. Place it on your screen. Where my palm is. The right hand of God is power. And out of the hand of God flows power. So place it on your screen right now. In the name of Jesus, olive oil, receive power. I speak to your olive oil. You are no longer olive oil, but anointing oil. In the name of Jesus Christ, receive power. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, receive power. Those of you who have water, after your place is on the screen, put it on your tables, put it on the floor, let it stand there and wait for my instructions on how you have to use it. Do not just drink it anyhow. Do not just start using it until I give you the instructions on how to use it. In the name of Jesus, holy oil, receive power. Olive oil, receive power. Olive oil, receive power. 
in the name of Jesus, those of you who want womb, children of the womb, I call fruit of the womb, buy an, an apple now, two apples. Madam one, husband one. Bring these apples to the screen right now and touch this apple on the screen. In the name of Jesus, your apple, it could be the local apple. It doesn't necessarily mean French apple. Touch it on the screen right now. I cry unto you, fruit of the womb, blessing. Touch your apple on the screen right now. Viewers all over the world, touch your apple on the screen right now. I told you, God can use anything to make you happy. Get your apple, whether your country apple that we eat in, in, the, in, the, in the towns here or the French apple. Touch it on the screen. I say now, 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 now. And the Lord is moving by the Spirit. The Lord is moving by the Spirit. And the Spirit of God has no limitations. And the Spirit of God is all over the world. As you touch the screen with your apple, something is going to happen after we instruct you on how to use it. Touch it on the screen right now. I will give you instructions on how to use these water, olive oil, and apple. You have prayed with water. Don't use it yet. Some of you want to start drinking. Don't drink until I tell you how to use it, how to drink it. Don't, please. Don't violate the instructions of the Spirit of God. Or else you become a lawbreaker. Hallelujah. And it may not work for you. So listen to the instructions I will give you so that it will work for you perfectly well. You've touched the apple on the screen and I cry unto the Lord, Abba, Father, plant power in within these apples. In the name of Jesus Christ, I cry unto you, Abba, Father, let these apples receive power. In your own very name, Jesus Christ. The name above all names. In heaven and on earth. Let these apples receive power. As the waters have received power. And the oil has received power. Let the apples likewise receive power. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My hand is still on the air. My hand is still on the air. You have a kerchief. You have a hand kerchief. Okay. It can be any color. But it should be brown in you. It should be a hand kerchief which has not been used. Touch it right now on your screen. Touch the kerchief on your screen. Big mommy, you get potica. All right. Buy new potica. Big papa, you get potica. Buy new potica. Touch and now for screen. Vous qui êtes les gens qui parlent en français là. Payez les mouchoirs. Touch it on the screen. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray with you now. That these kerchiefs receive power. In the name of Jesus. Refa magia tare. Ela rakanije kaim. Bodel ibra shelel karam. Melda hubra. Melda hubra. Idam rich gelash tome. Halash Bosch Taram Medal Dum Hebra Tizal Gel Tramashike Loros Kumareta Bedel Hegra Teles Gimorati Bedel Hegra Teles Tanum 
Bulak da drifa helet pano rakami. Bedesh tremarati tremashina radom. Bedel hiza kereb karim. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. These are the instructions now how to use it. You have water in a bottle. Take the cork of the bottle. Take the cork of the olive oil. Put the olive oil in the cork. Put the water in the cork of your bottle. See, in the name of Jesus, I drink. Drink the first time. You drink three times. In the name of Jesus, I drink. You drink the second time. In the name of Jesus, I drink. Drink the third time and say, Amen. I repeat, you drink three times. In the name of Jesus, the first time you drink. In the name of Jesus, the second time you drink. In the name of Jesus, the third time you drink. And cork the remainder and keep it. Don't drink it. Until tomorrow morning at the self same hour, repeat the process. And for you to anoint it, put a little on the cock, pour where there is pain, and rub it over. The pain must disappear now. You have a sore, it has refused to get healed. Put a little on the cock and anoint that sore. It, can, it could be a cancerous sore, and it will heal immediately in the name of Jesus. For those of you with apples, husband and wife, eat the apple thrice and finish it. The first time you bite hard, in the name of Jesus, bite. Big one, eh? Because you did it three times, not four times. In the name of Jesus, the second bite, big, big one again. And the third time, in the name of Jesus, the apple is finished. Husband and wife. Okay. Now the Lord is cleansing your loins. Taking away all the impurities. And you are now fine. Receive your children in the mighty name of Jesus. You are healed. Receive your babies in the mighty name of Jesus. This type next year some of you we put your babies like this or here and you'll be saying god is good yes the lord is good all the time the lord is good and so i skip from that right now and we go now to um testimonies for testimonies all of you know that when it's time for testimonies, people are always very happy because they testify to the goodness of God. You are requested to come to the Church of All Nations, which is called the Disciples' Church of All Nations, to receive your own testimony. A great deal of testimonies that are taking place here. People have breakthroughs. People have healings. People have prophecies. Yesterday, I visited one of my daughter. We still are, are staying around Moya. And she told me, Daddy, what you told me in the prophecy that my mom is sick is true. My mom was seriously sick at the time you prophesied this to me. But now she's recovering. Daddy, it is true. I went and visited, we went and visited our mother and we found that she was seriously sick. Also, I told one of my congregants that a former husband is sick with Indwala. She will not accept it. But when information came from the former husband himself that he was sick, 
she then confirmed that actually I told her in prophecy that her former husband was sick. Hallelujah. And many others also that the prophesied to, the prophecies have come to pass. Some of them give prophecies of when I said, family member of theirs will take plane and fly over, and they flew. And some of them again are about to fly, and some are coming in also. Hallelujah. So here we have <coughs> testimony time, midday, every 12 o'clock. <coughs> In the auditorium of the Disciples Church of All Nations, every Sunday we have prophetic hour. You need to come so that you can be prophesied unto, <clears throat> and so that strings that were attached to you to cause you not to move forward, by the word of prophecy they will be laid bare, and you will know where your troubles have come from, and the Lord will cut the strings off you and you make your progress and nothing will hold you back again i wish to thank god for one of my daughters in the compound who was pregnant and recently that was three days ago she gave birth to a baby boy that was that is really bouncing you know these baby boys that are bouncing it means when you throw them on the ground <clears throat> like a football they will begin to bounce <laughs> <laughs> but don't throw your baby on the ground like a football for it will not bounce <laughs> it will only die so she gave birth to a bouncing baby boy and I'm very very grateful that she gave birth to the child free from caesarean section she was not a prey upon the baby was born freely as, the, as an a Hebrew woman could give birth to child I glorify the Lord Almighty for the work well done by his holy hand. Hallelujah. 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 And for one also that I prayed for, that the Lord should heal his wound, and the wound is healing rapidly. Even though my medical interventions also. He's a son of mine, resident with me in Moliko. His wound that he obtained through an accident that nearly claimed his life is also healing rapidly. So I give the glory to God Almighty that he's also doing fine. I wish to also thank God for my son who wrote the common entrance after I prayed for him using his pen and anointed him that he will score highly in the common entrance of this year. And he went and wrote and passed the common entrance in list A. Hallelujah. He passed very well and is going to make the secondary school in September. I'm talking to you, to stu to you students likewise. When you come, we shall pray for you and the performances at school will ameliorate. I have students in my church that I prayed for. Their performances at school now have ameliorated. They are now performing better than they used to do. And they themselves testify to me that they are scoring highly now because of the prayers that I pray for them and because of the Holy Spirit in the church that keeps, keeps them free from encumbrances, from evil spirits that deter their progress in the educational field. I will just give you one of them. His name is called Yusuf Madiji, who is a Muslim, but is a convert in part. He's performing excellently well at school. His CAs are good and excellent. He testified before me that on his papers, he misses only two marks on his CAs. And his course very high. To his greatest surprise. Hallelujah. So students are not left out in this thing of the Lord. For some of the students who go and join secret calls in the university so that they can have high performances. Please, the Lord can do it better than those your secret calls. Because many students go to the universities and join secret calls and they kill their fellow students. 
The universities have secret calls. We students themselves, they make. I'm talking to you parents, be warned. Do not allow children to join the secret calls in the universities. They are very, very rampant in Nigeria. If you don't join their cult, you will not perform well at school. The Lord Almighty is greater than cults. The Lord is no respecter of cults. Some of them import pens from De Lorenz in order to write exams. Some of them import amulets from magicians. Some of them get magic pens to write exams so they can perform excellently well at school. All these things are useless because at the end tale, you will have to pay it with your blood. You will die when your parents never expected you to die. And the monies that they have used to sponsor you will become of no use. And your parents will bury you young because of the secret course that you joined while at school. Because you wanted to perform excellently well. It is, on, it is not called for. Come to Jesus Christ who has stretched out his arms even right at this moment. Calling on you to visit him even now in the Disciples Church of All Nations. You know, Jesus said, go in and make disciples of all nations. He never said, go in and make Christians of all nations. He said, go and make disciples of all nations. So come to the Disciples Church of All Nations and receive all these blessings. Bring your pains. I will pray over your pains. And when you write your exam, an angel will be with you helping you write your exams. I'm talking to you students. Are you a driver? Come and get my stickers and place it in your cars. Devil, that accident will start and toxic will drink your passenger their blood and your own. It will not happen. I have the stickers. I will present it to you. I don't sell them. I give it to you for free. I spend money and produce the speakers, the stickers, and I give it to you for free. On my stickers, you will see the fire of the Holy Ghost. For our Lord is a consuming fire. You see the sword. The word of God is sharper than any two-edged sword. And you will see the Holy Spirit in the form of a dove. These three will act in your car each time that demons and devils wish to cause you to have an accident. It will not, I repeat, not happen. These spirit items are available in the church auditorium now. We are going to have water which is going to be prayed for and the Holy Spirit will make it powerful that you come and we, you receive it freely. And if you care, bring your own water and I will pray over it and you will receive it and we do things that you never expected that it can do for you. For the Lord Almighty is able to do all things as he pleases. I pray now for all of us as we are cutting off this program. Lord, Father Almighty, they have received your word let it be a blessing unto them. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. And see you next time, Friday, 9 o'clock. Over.